Hey, I'm London Westy. And I'm Larry Class. For Cash Canada. And we're here for an island adventure on... Toronto Island or Toronto Island. Toronto Island. And uh, it's an island oasis just off the harbour from the downtown Toronto. And you can see the skyline from the back side of the island. And where we are, Lake Ontario. But we're here for some adventure and... Hopefully we can get some caches. Hopefully. Maybe not. We, we might not, but we we're going to have lots of fun. Already, so. And uh, we're here with our family, our two children, and uh, we're going to do some uh, canoeing, biking, and uh, caching maybe. And hiking. And we'll have fun. So come along for an adventure with us. It's a great place. It's an awesome day. place to see. Let's go take a look. Toronto it's way over there and we're over here on the island canoeing to get some caches unfortunately there's a dragon boat race this weekend and we can't get to half the caches and the one cache that we could get to on the water it's moved there was a redirect coordinates but unfortunately we just couldn't see it so uh, we put in a call to somebody that found it yesterday and unfortunately they didn't get back uh, so we're gonna run a bike and we're gonna go uh, try some other things and get some more caches well, what do you think? This is just amazing. I've never been here before. It's just a fabulous place to bring your family and there spend is, the day. There is so much to do and see, yeah. and you might actually be able to do some geocaching, although we haven't found anything yet. <laughs> but there is something that Lyric Lass really likes to do and it involves plants in a puzzle form. It's a maze. A maze. There's a maze here. We're just going to check it out now. are amazing. And uh, yeah, they are. So uh, let's go see if we can get lost or get out of the maze and maybe find a cache. Yes. Let's go. <laughs> William Meanie Maze. Who's William Meanie? I don't know who he is, but he's a real meanie. Uh, Eighteen meters. We're getting closer. Don't know if we're lost yet. We might get lost. You never know. We're lost. We're lost and we can't find the cache. Nope. We're not having good luck. Just can't find it. And it's hot. Do you know where the cache is? <laughs> well, we found the center of the maze, but we were trying to find the exit. 
So this is where the cache should be, and it's not here. And uh, we have no idea how to get out. Well, that's just in our estimation. And uh, so far, we haven't found one cache. We'll have fun, though. <laughs> Today was not a good day to cache on Toronto Island. The next cache we're after, just a, it's a two, two and a half, pretty simple. But it's right in there and the Dragon Boat team just came back. And uh, they have all their stuff there and I just don't feel like asking them for uh, help in finding a cache. So we're just gonna dive, chalk it up as another DNF. But we're having fun, and we're just not finding any caches. So we thought we were in luck because there's an earth cache here at the lighthouse, but it turns out when you go to the coordinates to the lighthouse and if you read the description before you go there it's actually the earth cache is not at the lighthouse it's out on the beach down at the lake you have to take a distance in bearing you have to do other, some other observations not at the lighthouse so we're going to check to see another cache first before we go to the lake uh, we might get a cache yet you never know that might just happen who knows <laughs> some adventures don't work out the way you want them to and some do but we're having still having a good time this is an amazing uh, island, a good destination to come if you want to get away from city life. Maybe not if you want to go caching, but hey, we're having a good time. Hey, after all the DNFs we've had... Wait, we found a cache, finally! <laughs> we had to find this one, it was a one and one, one and a half one. <laughs> there we go. Okay, we're good. We, we don't have to call this DNF Island. Okay, we're good now. Now we can go. We found a cache. That's it. We're good. <laughs> I feel like, I don't know what I... I feel like Geocaching Katie. The, day, the episode she had where she couldn't find anything. <laughs> but we got one. Yay! Yay! can't find some caches, you could try the optional beach, but uh, we're not going to go that way. We're heading off the island. Well, that was a fun adventure. Not exactly uh, what we had intended. Yeah, the caching, we just didn't get the caching today. No, it just wasn't our day, but you know, that happens. Yeah. But we had fun. We did. We dropped off some tractables at the one place. Yeah, and uh, we were out with the kids. and. That's more important, is family time with the kids, yes. and uh, they tolerated our caching. So. <laughs> anyway, don't forget to uh, like, share, and subscribe, and uh, we'll be sure to have some more adventures where we'll actually find some caches. <laughs> have a good day. See ya. There it is. Aha. Yay. Yay. We got one. We got another one. We couldn't get on the ferry without finding this last one. We know we, we knew we had to get this one. Uh, there was you no, no miss, and I don't have a pen. <laughs> <laughs> I got a pen. For you baseball fans, this is the place where Babe Ruth hit his only, his only uh, home run in the minor leagues, right here in Toronto, on Toronto Island, or close to here. Yeah, just wanted to share that with you in case you wanted to know.